short, we have moved to a new home and Fluffy's mom Fluffy is what I call my partner in crime He's kind enough to send us some parcels and care package from Hokkaido and that's what we're gonna do today Lots of air from Hokkaido. It's a normal um, bowl for rice. We have one of <laughs> We have a rice. And this is for miso soup. Mm -hmm. It's a very traditional, traditional, very Japanese style um, miso soup bowl. One of that. No, there should be two. Yep, and there you go. Bowl number two. Good. Ooh. Oh, I thought this was a mug. It's actually not a mug. How do I some beaker for cup. And this is oh, made in Japan, bro. More styrofoam. We ever needed that. Oh, I had this when I was back in Aichi. This is from uh, Snoopy. I have the same thing. Chopsticks, the girl chopsticks. Do these. Oh, a pretty one. Oh, I love like that. It's pretty. It's a glass. Oh. oh, very cute. It's Peter Rabbit. Sure. 
sure where she got it from, but thank you very much. Oh, this is so pretty. I'm, this is going to be one of the things that I'm going to use ever so, ever so much. Three different sizes of a plate. Thank you very much. And I like whites, actually. I love whites for plates because it shows... I don't know, it just looks like a plate. And we have another one of these, the green tea cups. Ooh. 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 I don't know, but it feels like it's a sake cup. But I mean, it can be a cup for anything, right? But it looks so pretty. Look at that. Japanese. From Hario, it says cha cha or cha cha.
let's see, covers. Stuff. 
so yeah, that's it for today. I hope you had fun and it was interesting for you to see what kind of things a Japanese mom would give to her son or to her uh, son's house, new house. But to sum it up, they like to give you towels and cleaning materials and some kitchen stuff. And also, don't forget the Aisatsuyo, the greetings for Greetings in Japan is very, very important. And this is one of the traditions that I really love about Japan. They have they have something so when you enter a house, when you go out of a room, when you you know first meet someone, you know, there's so many things, so many greetings that they have, and one of them is when you move to a new house, you get to greet your neighbors, say hi that you live here. Um, and just, you know, I don't even know how to say it, but in Japanese, this is, there's this word, Yoshiko Nanashimasu, which usually means what you say to someone. You usually say it, it's like a please in a different level, in a greeting level, I guess. And what are the ways to, you know, say please or, you know, look after my house when I'm gone? All that stuff to say hi is to give something to your neighbors, which usually is some little, some, something small, which yeah, we got from our mail. And you can also make this custom plate that you can have. It has a voice or whatever greeting you're gonna about to do. And then you can. It's also the same when you're getting married or some celebration or when you're congratulating someone for something there's a lot of different things that this thing can maybe you know about this thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoy goodbye